Hi, it's Pat Hood from Fashions and Pastimes, and this time I'm here with a Sarah Coventry update. These are pieces I've purchased from Karen Graham and Melody Boza. And I've purchased from Melody before, and they're just wonderful things again. Um, so we'll start with Melody's pieces. This is Chantilly Lace, and I have the earrings of this already. Uh, 1961 piece, um, or when it was first... Um, sold I guess I'm not sure how old this particular one is and um, what was I gonna say oh yeah the thing about Chantilly lace is that the gold tone can vary between pieces uh, you know from different years so these match my the earrings that I have quite nicely then there's this set called galaxy and uh, just love the uh, um, the colorful, these colorful plastic stones, the variety of them means, uh, you know, every set of galaxy is different. Uh, this might be a replacement pearl or just maybe that that's really dirty in there. I haven't quite figured that out, but it's definitely got a darker surround than the others. And there's some coloration over here, too. So I think maybe there's it's to do with some of the glue or something that got spilled and stuck on there. So I'll be trying to make a, do a judicious clean. And then here are the earrings. And uh, let's see, Galaxy is a 1962 issue. And again, um, I don't know the exact year for this set. And then we have... Oh, this amazing set of Monte Carlo and it's so wonderful to get a full set so we've got the clip earrings we've got the bracelet and we have the necklace and this is such a beautiful set um, and uh, there we are so if, I mean, there, that's a little easier to see the whole thing and um, Monte Carlo's from 1961 again. So a lot of 60s pieces here. Then um, from Karen, I'm going to put these off to the side. I already got them in my database. Now I just have to put them in the actual collection. Um, so... This is a piece I am thrilled to get. Um, uh, this is Starlet Trio. And it's a two-pin set. Sorry, I just have to... There we go. So this pin... Hmm. Figure out how to get it out of there. It's supposed to slide. This is supposed to slide out of there. Anyway, so it's two pins together that then um, can be worn separately or together. And it is missing part of the pin uh, clasp over here. But that is an easy repair. I have uh, actually lots of replacement pieces of those, vintage replacement pieces. So just got to figure out how to get this pin slid out of that pin. And... Uh, Oh, well, I'll do that off camera. Anyway, a gorgeous piece and one I've been uh, had on my wish list for quite a while. And that's 1962. And then there's this lovely set. I always like getting things in sets. So here's the um, clip-on earrings. And here's the brooch, the pin. And this is called Sunflower. It's from 1966. There's another little set, and this is, um, see, quite a bit of difference in terms of, you know, pin size. Um, this is called Petite, 
So, you know, small earrings, small brooch, and it's from 1966 as well. So you put the two 66s together and you see quite a difference. So it's nice to see something called petite. Uh, I'm sure that there were people who were very happy to see something of a smaller size. And then finally, this um, is the start of uh, a new set for me. This is these are the debutante earrings from 1962, and I look forward to trying to find the other pieces to go with it. So, just a few pieces, but um, a really nice uh, grouping of items, and great additions. to my Sarah Coventry collection. Thanks for joining me. Hope to see you soon. Bye for now.